Flat Earthers frequently claim that shadows always get larger with increasing distance from the uh, place, the screen, as it were, where the shadow is being cast. And they show demonstrations that that's the case. However, in all their demonstrations, they are using light sources that are smaller than the objects casting the shadow. I'm not going to do that. Uh, today I have a wiffle ball. Uh, I've taped over the holes so that it doesn't uh, allow light to pass through. We've got it on a string. We'll see why in a minute. And I have here a floodlight. Now the floodlight is four and a half inches across. Wiffle ball is the size of a regulation baseball. It's about two and three quarter inches across. So consequently it's smaller than the light source. And that's the key point. When light sources are lar smaller than the objects that cast shadows, indeed the shadows get larger with increasing distance. However, if the light source is larger, as is the case with the sun, then the the shadow gets smaller with increasing distance. And I'm going to demonstrate this by lifting this up, getting on this ladder, step ladder, and I will put the wiffle ball at a certain height. I have a piece of tape here so I can run it across a beam in the ceiling of my basement where I can keep the height the same. And so I can uh, put the wiffle ball over here against the wall, against the screen, which is a, just a card table. And then I am going to uh, slide it forward toward the light source. And as I slide it, you'll notice that the shadow, when I start pulling out, you can see the shadow better. The shadow has a certain size. But notice as I get closer to the light source, that is farther from the screen, the shadow diminishes in size. It's rocking a little bit. I'll let it stop for just a moment here. And you can see the penumbra growing. There's a grayish outer portion to the shadow. It's getting larger. And as we go out that umbra, the inner portion there is getting smaller and smaller. Again, it's rocking a little bit, but when I get to about here, the umbra is pretty well disappearing. All you're seeing is a penumbra. I stop it from swinging. You'll see better. I keep going towards the light source, the umbra completely disappears. Now if I move it back from the light source, getting closer to the screen, you'll see that the umbra reappears. It's kind of small, but as I get closer to the screen, the umbra gets progressively larger. So again, when the distance from the, uh, sh from the object to the shadow is small, the uh, shadow is rather large. But as I increase the distance, the shadow diminishes, thus disproving the claim of many flat earthers.